young drivers in this 26 car field. Well, they sat in these very grandstands many years ago, just hoping and praying that one day they would compete out here. And today that dream becomes a reality. This is the Mac Daddy of them all. This is the Long Beach Grand Prix circuit. No, we'll be going green this lap. Green, 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 green. Street courses are nothing new for this series, but being here at Long Beach certainly is something special. These two guys, oh, look at that. They trace some paint there. Jamie tries to give him a little bump there, coming off the hairpin. That was a great move by Penske Porsche. How hard do you press, Johnny, as soon as the green flag comes out? Capra is struggling with that Ferrari right now. Disaster and drama at the head of GTLM. And who's got the horsepower down the back straight? They have very little to lose at this point. Take a shot at it. Face the track is Saturday night dirt track race. What? Oh. Three more positions. He's been hit. He's been hit by the second Corvette. Pagano's close. Pagano is really close. Oh, oh he, he gets sideways. Can he get it? Can he hold it? He's in the lead now, but can he keep it? And he got blocked there, and the number 10 car goes through. Picked the wrong way there, didn't he? Hear the crew. Keep him behind you. Keep him behind you. He's been so quick to no. hear. Gets turned. Unbelievable. Go. The launch. Go, go, go. You hear the checkered flag waves. Simon Pagano, an unlikely victor, but he takes the checkered flag. DHL Penske's room on the They've done it, the triple, triple, and a win again at Long Beach in the Cadillac DPI. Here comes the number 50. What a story for WeatherTech, Riley Racing. Yeah, you know, I had a Bubba Burger before the race, and I think that uh, that may have been what, it, uh, what did it.